The silence is deafening from Tennessee Republican leaders about former President Donald Trump's comment that Vice President Kamala Harris decided to, quote, turn black. We asked News 2's Kenley Harga to find out whether Tennessee Republicans who say they support Trump support what Trump is saying about her race. She was always of Indian heritage, and she was only promoting Indian heritage. I didn't know she was black until a number of years ago when she happened to turn black, and now she wants to be known as black. In front of an audience of black journalists, former President Trump questioned Vice President Kamala Harris's race. She's the first black woman and Asian American to serve as vice president. She was Indian all the way, and then all of a sudden she made a turn, and she went, she became a black person. Just be the vice president is of Indian and Jamaican descent. She graduated from Howard University, which is a historically black college and university. Also, she is a member of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, a leading black sorority. News 2 has reached out to Governor Bill Lee, Senators Marsha Blackburn and Bill Haggerty, and Representatives Andy Ogles and Mark Green for comments on his remarks. None got back to us. Always but identified you know as a black woman. I respect she went to a historically either one. Black college. I respect either one, but she obviously doesn't. Years ago, Trump spread the false theory that the United States' first African American president, Barack Obama, was not born in the United States. Trump has denied allegations of racism. Vice President Harris was in Texas Wednesday and responded to the former president's remarks. Donald Trump spoke at, at the, the annual, annual meeting, meeting of the National, National Association, Association of Black, black Journalists. journalists. And it was the same old show. The divisiveness and the disrespect. And let me just say, the American people deserve better. The former president also says he has been the best president for black population since Abraham Lincoln. Former President Trump's next rally is Friday in Montana, and Vice President Harris was in Houston today to deliver the eulogy at Texas Representative Sheila Jackson Lee's funeral. Bob.